What was the street again? Plum Street. It's one, this is, this is Stark Avenue. I've worked in every environment in the geriatric world, and I have never in my career seen a company pioneer a program like this. Larry actually <laughs> was really skeptical. He was like really closed off and like, oh, what are they selling? I picked it up right away. He was beaming <laughs> and he's very reserved. Ready? Are you ready to go home? Ready to go home. That's a good, good place to go. A lot of our residents, as time goes on, depression and anxiety, and this kind of like gets them out of that, puts them in a place and good times in their family. Are you looking at your house right now? Yeah, a lot of, a lot of memories. And I've seen the house and where I grew up. I was born in that house. The big lawn and bank in front of the house, which I used to cut the grass all the time. It was always a real pain in the ass. <laughs> it's just kind of like music, you know? It just kind of takes you back to that moment in time. Did you ever think in your lifetime you'd be able to? Never, <laughs> never, 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 never. <laughs> You can kind of teleport yourself into a different time of your life or a travel experience or a place that you are dreaming of. How long were you and your wife married? 32 years. Wow. What I'm most excited about is being able to play games with residents. I know that a lot of our patients are very competitive. Me and you right now, it's going down. Three, two, one. I'm popping. I would pop them all. Go, go, go. Oh, man. Ooh. You want to do it again? Yeah. Get your breath. <laughs> yeah, I beat her. <laughs> one. <laughs> We actually had a patient in her 90s, and she was a pilot. She's a patient that was otherwise um, just kind of withdrawn and very quiet. She just came out of her shell, and she was laughing. And of course, after the, the whole experience was done, she wanted to talk about it more. We spend our whole life being independent, learning how to walk, do things by ourselves, and we start losing that. Not only is it a loss of identity, but a loss of just dignity, being able to put them in that brief moment where they can have choice of where they go, I think it's a huge gift. You're not alone in this world. You can go anywhere you want to go, vacation, in your mind. You don't have to leave your, leave your couch. <laughs>